What's up YouTube? Have you wondered how to use snapping to align your objects in Procreate Dreams? Well, that's what we're here to talk about today. Welcome back, my name is Ben Nielsen. I'm a media design educator, and today we're talking about how to use snapping inside of Procreate Dream. So this was something that really kind of confused me for a while, and I talked about it in my last video, and many people on YouTube were kind enough to comment and let me know how to do it. So snapping allows you to take an object and get it to snap directly into place. And this is really important, say, if we want to move a title across the screen and keep it in the middle of the screen the whole time, or just if we want objects to all line up together. It's really important, and as we know, alignment is one of the fundamental principles of design. And I'm happy to say that it is in Procreate, although it's a little hard to find. Basically, what you have to do is while you're dragging an object, you need to hold one finger down on the screen. So drag an object with the Apple Pencil and hold down one finger on the screen elsewhere to keep snapping turned on so it will stay in alignment. Let me show you how this works here with an introduction title. Okay, so basically I have this word introduction here on the screen and I want to move it in from the side and then across. And I want it to pause. When I scrub through here, you'll see that I have this draw on. I want it to pause right there. So we're going to keyframe this in. We want it to be right in the middle where it is right now when the draw on animation starts. So let's go ahead and we'll tap here on the little clapper and we'll get our move keyframes and we're going to do move and scale. So now we've set a keyframe there and we have one at the beginning. We're going to go ahead and drag back to our one at the beginning so that we're right there. And then grabbing our introduction, we can move it, but we can't keep it in alignment unless we hold this one finger on the screen. One finger on the screen, and now we get this line showing us exactly where the alignment is. So let's drag that off. And now if we click play, we'll watch it move in. Okay, they automatically put easing on, which is nice, and then it draws on. Now after the draw on animation, we wanna go ahead and move it off the screen. So let's go ahead and come right here to where the draw on animation ends. We'll make sure that we've set a keyframe there. And then we're going to go to the end again. And we don't have quite enough room, so I'm going to zoom out with a pinch. Drag, hold down one finger on the screen. Okay, so we set that there. And now we can watch through our whole title. And then it moves off. Okay, so there's obviously a lot more that we could do with that. But that's basically how you're going to keep snapping on. So you can use that to line up all of your different objects and make things work the way you want them to. Okay, this was just a real quick short video. I'm still working on getting out that Procreate Brushes course for you. So keep an eye out for that. That will be coming out really soon. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next video.